Scorpio, welcome back, guys. So today we're going to do a reading. We're going to see what is going on with you and this ex of yours. We're going to see what does this person want to tell you, okay? We're, see, we're also going to see what are their overall energies towards this connection, their actions, and we're going to predict what the outcome will be between you and this individual. Guys, before we get started, please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Hit that notification bell. It allows me to connect in... Uh, it allows me to connect with you, and it also allows me to grow on the channel. Jesus. Um, also, guys, time is fluid, so whenever you find this reading, you are meant to hear it. And there is no gender in tarot. Please reverse the roles as need be. Crosswatchers, you are always welcome. I meant to say it helps me connect with you energetically. I was about to say electronically. That too, but whatever. Spirit has their own way of saying stuff. So let's see. What's, what's this overall energy here between you and this person? What is this person's current thoughts, energies towards you? How are they feeling about this connection? Let's be some nosy, nosy ass people. Universe, Archangel, Spirit, Angel, Guides, and Guardians. What is going on with Scorpio? What is this overall energy with Scorpio's ex? What is Scorpio's ex thinking and feeling about this connection here? Unsure. I want to talk to you, but I don't know what to say. So here's somebody that wants to have a conversation with you. They just don't know how to open up those lines of communication. Well, I just heard they sure as hell said enough when they walked away. Why can't you call back and say something? Apologize. Speak a truth. Bring some clarity. You're talking about somebody here who is feeling a little bit emotionally insecure. They're afraid. Okay. Um, too many, too many walls up on both sides. You both are defensive. Okay. They feel like you're going to be in this defensive energy. Hence why they're afraid. Okay. Um, you feel like they're a little bit in the defensive energy as well, because I got to be honest with you, Scorpio. I feel like you both have somewhat the same point of view in this situation, but very different. Okay. Um, when you and this person got into that argument, it went from literally from it being one topic to it becoming 80 billion different other topics, which ultimately caused the, the rip in the relationship. Um, somebody here had a lot of friends and family members that were just interfering in the connection. People that had no freaking business whatsoever to doing your relationship. Okay. Did not wake up with you guys and they did not go to sleep with you guys. So you did have a bunch of people, um, being nosy in the connection. This person is holding on to you, and they are holding on to a lot of sadness, okay? Um, they can't seem to stop thinking about you. It is a very overwhelming energy. You have someone, Scorpio, who is very emotionally inclined, and I feel like their eyes tear up every so often throughout the day. But they're also angry. I'm not going to lie to you. They're mad. They're mad at themselves because they walked away or they took the wrong action. And they're mad at you because they feel like you didn't listen to them. Okay? And it's vice versa. I feel like the feeling is mutual. Okay? So this person is definitely holding on to you. Okay? And I feel like they've had different opportunities to, to contact you, to call you. But either they, they stopped the message or they just they don't proceed with the phone call okay even through messenger so some of you guys check out your messenger you might have a message in there but this person is still holding on to you there is a lot of sadness and the truth of the matter my love there's a lot of signs and synchronicities i'm constantly reminded of you i'm telling you you every turn around every corner this person turns there goes a sign of you someone looks like you someone drives the same car as you somebody smells like you like something is constantly reminding them of you they also have something within their possession in their car it could be somebody's hair scrunchy or have something that has to do with you but this person is constantly reminded of you someone's shampoo is still in this person's house because i clearly clearly pictured a shampoo bottle in the shower so this person is definitely seeing a lot of signs and synchronicities about you this is true love my love okay this is true love i feel like you and this person do have a lot of love for each other unfortunately at the time being or at the current moment there's some misunderstandings going on you know what? I'm getting a very beautiful vibe in this connection, Scorpio. I'm not going to lie to you. I split the deck at the Eight of Cups in the reverse. This person's coming back. I'm going to I'm going to go ahead and take that take that um that leap of faith. I never claim certain actions. You can tell when I do my personal readings with some of my clients, I tell them I'm not I I don't I don't confirm certain things like that, but I'm going to tell you this right now. I'm going to confirm that this person is coming back. They're coming back, okay? You need to be prepared for this. Some of you guys are going to have to learn how to agree to disagree, I just heard. Agree to disagree, my love. Because we're never going to see eye to eye with that person. Sometimes it's just best to meet halfway, okay? Meet halfway. 
Universe, Archangels, Spirit, Angel, Guides, and Guardians. Please help me give Scorpio clear and concise messages. How is their ex feeling towards them at the moment? How are they feeling towards this connection, this relationship? Universe, Archangel, Spirit, Angel, Guides, and Guardians. How is their ex feeling about them and this connection at the moment? Tower moment. They want some major, major changes. If I would have taken this out in the reverse, they don't want this to end. Either way, this person wants this connection to change, okay? They want this connection to change. They want to bring the clarity, hangman energy. They're tired of this confused energy. They're tired of not having this communication with you. If you have them blocked, go ahead and unblock them. That's confirmation for someone out there. But somebody here is going to end up taking the initiative. They're going to take control of this situation. It can very well be your person, Scorpio. But I keep on hearing we have to meet halfway, okay? We have to learn how to agree to disagree, okay? So this may even be a mutual reconciliation right here. We're going to have to meet halfway with this person, okay? Um, my Scorpio, my love, all my love and respect to you guys, but I feel like I am dealing or I'm reading for a little bit of a stubborn Scorpio, okay? Universe, Archangel, Spirit, Angel, Guides, and Guardians, what is this overall energy in this relationship for Scorpio? The justice. You as well are on the same page, Scorpio. No lie. You both want justice. You both want clarity. You both want this, this separation to come to an end. You want the changes to, to be made. King of Swords energy. You both are in this place right now where you just want to have this conversation. Okay? You both want to have this conversation. But my stubborn asses, neither one of you guys have reached out yet. Page of Pentacles in the reverse. Okay? Somebody here is going to have to take the initiative, Cross Watcher. Or Scorpio initiative someone's gonna have to take the control here in this situation i do gotta be honest with you whoever it is that decides to reach out the other person will take your message in a good energy in a positive energy okay universe archangels spirit angel guides and guardians does a scorpio's ex still have love for them are they still in love here do they have feelings for my scorpio oh really it can't be made any more clear than this scorpio any more clear this is your freaking soulmate this is your soulmate okay i just feel like i'm dealing with two stubbornness that's it i'm just reading for two stubborn people D this is your soulmate guys again i will never confirm anything unless my spirit guide is pushing me to do so but there is a definite a definite reconciliation happening here the only thing going on here is that we both are being stubborn here okay somebody or either both one or the other or I'm, I'm suggesting both have to put that guard down and have to move towards this connection okay it is time to open up these lines of communication because you and this person a soulmate energy you guys have a lot to celebrate in the very near future and let's get to celebrating universe archangels spirit angel guides and guardians what is this person's plans towards my scorpio what do they plan to do within the next six to eight weeks reason why i say six to eight weeks guys because my readings are for the next couple of months these energies can very well happen for you within the next six to eight weeks um if this is something that you truly want honestly um would love to be back together with this person then confirm affirm that these are the messages for you and manifest them into your life okay what is this person's next actions towards my scorpio universe didn't I say, didn't I freaking say, Page of Pentacles, they're going to be uh, communicating with you, okay? They will be reaching out here within the next six to eight weeks. Like I told you guys, is this, this can very well happen sooner rather than later, but you are getting an apology, Scorpio, okay? I feel like the apology is going to be mutual, okay? So don't, don't kill the messenger here. Don't shoot the messenger. I'm just telling you. I feel like in this circumstances due to this situation, there's going to have to be a mutual apology here. Four of Swords energy, okay? So within the next four hours, four days, four weeks, I do feel like there's going to be full-blown communication between you and this individual. In this given time right now, Hermit energy, Four of Swords energy, take full advantage of this time that you are alone and learn how to forgive and forget okay because it is time to let go of some type of anger or resentment from the past okay in order to be able to move forward what are the predictions outcome in this relationship for scorpio and the person that's on their mind universe the three of swords energy in the reverse so an ending of a heartache okay page of wands energy communicating conversating ace of wands energy having a passionate new beginning Okay, so you and this person are being told once again confirmation that there is going to be a new beginning in this situation and you will be able to heal this past trauma, this anger, this resentment that you hold for each other or one for the other, vice versa. 
okay? Again, another confirmation that this connection will be coming back together and there's going to be an opportunity for a reconciliation here. You must trust the process, my love, okay? You must trust each other and trust the process. Some of you guys, Scorpio, or maybe cross watchers, will have to learn how to trust your person that sometime when they're trying to take a direction or an initiative in this relationship is that they're doing it for their higher good and your higher good as well, okay? So sometimes we have to learn, I am notorious for that myself, we have to learn how to be the passenger, okay? What is the advice that we have for Scorpio here? Universe, Archangels, Spirit, Angel, Guides, and Guardians. Romantic feelings. You guys still have a lot of love for each other, okay? There, this, this connection is worth exploring the, the relationship one more time, okay? Approach the situation in a playful energy. Attempt, try not to hold on to whatever happened in the past, okay? Whatever has happened in the past, happened in the past. There's no way we can change it. All we can do is move forward, learn our lesson, and call it a day, okay? Calling in your soulmate. If this is who you truly honestly want to be with, my love, you call this person. You affirm this person. You confirm that this is your person because there's wedding here. There is marriage here, okay? So get yourself ready, Scorpio, all right? Your person, your soulmate, the one that you're meant to be with, the one that you are going to guarantee a reconciliation with is coming back towards you and it's time for you guys to meet each other halfway okay we are both gonna have to learn how to agree to disagree in this situation to have a beautiful successful abundant marriage okay guys i hope and pray that this reading gave you the clarity that you needed don't forget to like share and subscribe click that notification bell and if anyone is interested in a personal reading the information is in the description box below i'll talk to you guys soon take care bye